guys welcome back CFP here and this is survival living so I do want to apologize for not having many videos here lately I just been working a lot more hours and a lot more days at work so you got to pay the bills right all right so we've got a package that has came in uh, I had contacted a good friend Dominique um, he has his own YouTube channel which is over there and also in the description uh, I was asking about some flint because when we go to Pathfinder course we're gonna have to um, start a fire with flint and steel um, and we also have to start a fire with using our knife and flint. Now, in my fire kit, I do have flint, but I have what's known as flakes. All right, see how thin these are? These are real easy to shatter, break. So, that's what I was going to take with us. But, he sent us up a little package here. Of course, it's got his own handwritten note there and he sent us some flint and some other items now first off I want to show this right here this is a handmade pouch leather strap I believe that's stone up here for the strap but this is canvas that's been waxed it has three additional pockets so I already checked it out my flint steel will fit in this thing so yeah, this is all handmade, hand stitched and everything. Uh, he sent this along with the flint and stuff. Next up, he has a sticker for his YouTube channel. Fired it up, it's a smoking, oh yeah, nice. That's gonna be uh, going on the truck. All right, so we have some English flint. He sent us a package of that. Now, I will be testing this stuff out, guys, but this is a lot thicker chunk of flint compared to the flakes. Let me set this in here. We'll go over what all we got before we start striking. All right, and this is Florida chert. He sent some of this. I went ahead and tested this stuff out. This actually works really well. I do like these. They spark really nicely. Um, so what I'm going to be doing, I'm probably going to be taking two of each with me to the course. And we've got some uh, fire material. I broke off a couple pieces the other day, and it makes a really good coal. Um, so he sent us two big old blocks of that. But this isn't flint. This is a material that catches fire and actually makes a really nice coal. So, with everything out of the box, let's get to striking. All right, guys, so we got a piece of the English flint. I got a piece of char cloth here. We're going to place it on our flint. Got our striker. There it is. So, works very well. So that is our piece of English flint. Like I said, there's quite a few in here. We've got uh, four large pieces, and we will be taking two of those with us to the course. Next up, we have the Florida chert. We've got our char cloth. Let's set it up on here. Already. So yeah, works very well. I do like having these larger pieces because it does not take much to break these little flakes compared to a much larger piece and if I chip away my edges I can always uh, pop them off and re-shelf the edge compared to these when they're done they're just done so that is that guys definitely appreciate you hanging out with us we do have another weekly prep video coming up I've just been working a lot of hours as a matter of fact I think I'm putting in seven days straight this week 
So I will get it dropped for you guys. Just bear with us. Got a lot of stuff going on. Definitely appreciate all the support we've had this past month, whether it be just watching our videos or our new channel memberships that have been joining or also our PayPal support. That does help us out. Never required, but I do appreciate the support that we've been receiving from our community. So anyway, guys, y'all take care. Speak to y'all later.